Problem one, we want to multiply the binomial n plus 7 times the binomial n plus 10. So we're going to shake hands. Each piece will get distributed through. So this n will get distributed through to that n. n times n is n squared. Now the n will get distributed through to the 10. That's 10n. This 7 will get distributed through. That's 7n. And then 7 through to the 10 is 70. Now, does anybody go together? Yes. The middle pieces in this case, 10n and 7n is 17n. So our final answer is a trinomial. <clears throat> Let's look at this guy. This is an interesting one. n times n is n squared. Now n times that 5 is 5n. We continue here, distribute through. That's minus 5n. And then negative 5 times positive 5 is subtract 25. Notice this time when we put the pieces together, gain 5n, lose 5n, it goes away. And we're left with the answer of another binomial, n squared minus 25. This is called a difference of squares. When this center part cancels out, because notice you're doing an n minus 5 times an n plus 5. You're going to get this center piece going away, and you'll get an answer like this of n squared minus 25.